Hi, this is John from PortableFreewearGames.com and I'm not here to show you a game. What I'm here to do is to actually show you how to change the skins in VLC Media Player. This is it here, VLC Media Player. It's a freeware op application and it's probably the best uh, media player out there. It plays just about anything, uh, including broken codecs, if you can believe that. Uh, and I think it's just great. The one problem I have, the one dislike I have with VLC Media Player up until now, it's not been very customizable. Uh, you could download a skin maker from the website, but it was rubbish to tell you the truth, it really wasn't worth it. Yeah, but that's changed now, VLC have made it much easier to change the look of your, your media player. Uh, the, the, the system is very similar to Winamp and Windows Media Player, where you go into the website and you download a skin and you add it to your media player. And that's exactly what we're going to do. So if you go to your browser, And you, you type in videoland.org. I want you to choose the VLC option here. Let's go down to skins. And you can choose whatever skin you like. There's dozens here. Uh, I'm just going to choose the first one that looks fun. This one here, Dark Voodoo. I'll click on that. And scroll down a wee bit. As you can see, the download size is 139 kilobytes, which is practically nothing. Uh, so I'm going to download this. Save. And I'll just close this down. And I'll pick out the file from my downloads folder. This is it here. Dark Voodoo. Okay, now to add these to the VLC media player, it's very simple. You just turn, open up your own media player. Right click on the screen anywhere you like. Click on Tools, and down to Preferences, and here's, here's your options for your skin. Right now it's on Use Native Skin, that's the default skin for v VLC Media Player. But it gives you another option here to use Custom Skin. So if you click on that, and you click on the Choose button, and you have to, to, to browse to the file that you just downloaded. Now mine is on my desktop, so I know it'll be in here somewhere. That just went past it. Darkvoodoo.vlt. Then save. And that's it loaded up. Uh, the next time we open up Windows Media, Windows VLC player, uh, it's going to look very different. So let's shut this down and then open it back up again. As you can see, it's taken on this, this different skin. Uh, kind of dark, kind of moody, quite cool. Uh, I like this. Uh, but look, let's try it again, let's get another skin and see what the next one's like. So again, just open up your browser. Videoland.org Choose VLC, Skins. And I'll choose another skin to download. What else is there out here? Uh, Nintendo Black Style? No. Nah. Quick time, no. It's Sony PSP. If you want your your media player to look like a, a pony, a Sony PSP player. What about this one here, JVC VLC? Uh, let's give that a go. It looks okay. Download. And save it. I'll just get the file out of my downloads folder. There it is there. And again, it's the same process again to install it. You right click on the screen, you go to interface, and then down to uh, interface, and down to preferences, and you get to choose your skin. Uh, this is the JVC VLC I'm looking for. So. Just look. That's their JVC VLC. Save. And that's it loaded up. And the next game, next time I open up this media player, uh, it'll look very different to what it does right now. And there it is there. 
quite cool. Again, I'll do it one more time just to make sure you've got the hang of this. Make sure I've got the hang of this actually. So right click on the in fact, wait a minute, we need to download something first. Uh, go to your browser. Go to videoland.org. I'm going to choose VLC skins. Let's scroll down. See what they've got. Here's one that looks like Winamp. Uh, I quite like Winamp, so I'm going to download this. Okay, okay. 123 kilobytes. Let's download this. Okay. And again, here we go. Get out of the downloads folder. This is called Modern. Dot VLT as in the modern type of Winamp, not the classic type. Right click on the screen, interface, preferences, choose desktop. Now I'm looking for something called modern.vlt. Modern.vlt, it's it there. Save. And I'm going to close this down. And the next time I open it up, it'll look very different. And there it is there. It just looks exactly like uh, the Winamp, if you've ever had the Winamp on your computer. That's uh, the modern face for Winamp. The graphic equaliser here. Quite a cool little application. But anyway, that's all. I just thought I'd show you something that I'd, I found out. Uh, I hope you have a lot of fun messing around with your VLC media player. Like I said, it's a very powerful, very very varied in what it can do. Uh, and it's a very versatile little application. I hope you have fun. Thanks for watching and I hope you download. I hope you download this and I hope you subscribe.